hi lovelies welcome and welcome back to my channel my name is petite given mk thank you so much for clicking if you're new to this channel you are so welcome don't forget to hit the subscribe button so you can join the pg gang which is the best family in the world and uh, yeah then um, that is all you're with us like, you're here to stay <laughs> yeah so i'm so excited you guys today because i am about to do something that i have not yet done on my channel i have been wanting to do this for a while but i have not been able to and uh, so i'm very excited because for to today actually i'm going to be doing a review for the first time i'm going to be reviewing a product which was made by some zambian um girl very beautiful girl very talented so she recently just launched her um, makeup brand which consists of different types of makeup and so i got myself a makeup palette and i also got some eyelashes so that i can just try them and see what i think about them and then i'm also going to tell you what i think about this product are they worth buying are they worth spending your money on and yeah so i'm going to be giving you candid like like, um real review because this is not a sponsored video i bought this for myself so she's not sponsoring me i just want to try them out and give you what i think or rather tell you what i think i feel about these products so yeah let's get straight into this video so guys these are the products i'm sorry i'm so close to you i have to move a bit, bit behind so you can see these things properly so this is how her makeup comes it looks something like this yeah it is in white package like this and then i also got myself some eyelashes so i got these i try to get the most dramatic eyelashes because i want them to look so dramatic and i just love dramatic eyelashes so this is what she told me is dramatic in her line so i'm going to be trying out these and then i'm also going to be trying out her makeup palette i'm so excited now the packaging i think with the packaging i'm already impressed this is a, a white package i uh, i'm not so sure how i'm going to maintain the cleanness of this package because of my makeup on my hands and everything but i like that it is white and it is sophisticated very luxurious so it looks so clean i just don't know how most of us are going to maintain the cleanness of this but i hope we do so it's actually in a box so you have to slide out the makeup like that so this is the little box which is covered on the outside and then this is what the makeup looks like so it has some kind of like magnetic feel to it so when you're opening and when you're closing it actually closes like magnet so it can't open on its own unless you actually have to like pull to open so this is what it looks like it has so many beautiful colors that you can see i'm so excited because you can see it has some matte colors like these right here the greens all these here are all matte colors and then it also has some glitter in it and also some shimmer uh makeups like these this are this is shimmer all these are shimmer so we have some shimmer we have some matte and we also have some glitter in this pack so it comes like it's a whole full package the only thing that i'm not so um keen about is the fact that the colors are not named so you know it's not easy to tell somebody who is far away like you're probably going to say use green but then there are three greens here but if it's if the colors were named like you know how some people some palettes actually have names like rosy you know or just people's names just so that it, it makes it easier to even when i'm making a review i'll be saying i'm using this color right now i won't be mentioning to say i'm using i won't just be pointing but in this case i'm just going to be pointing to say i'm using this color if they were named i'll be saying um, i'll be mentioning the name to say i'm using bossy for example i'm using beautiful for example you know so that is the only thing that has put me off right now but so far the packaging the little mirror up here comes in handy because you don't have to pack another mirror and uh, the pack itself it is clean and nice it has some um, lips i don't think you can see them on camera but it does have some lips drawn on them they are actually very clear so you can't see them on camera but yeah i'm so excited to try this palette so yeah i'm going to come close so that um i can try this out for you guys so i'm going to zoom in myself so that um you guys are going to be able to see what i'm doing so with this, um, I'm going to try to use as many colors as possible because I'm not swatching them on my hands. So I'm going to be trying them direct on my eyes. So I want to see how that plays out. I'm going to be looking at the consistency, of, um, the pigment, and also everything. Are there any fallouts? So that is what I'm going to be looking at whilst I'm using this palette. 
so yeah let's get started um i'm immediately drawn to this red right here just because i love red and i love it it looks pink on the video but it is red so i'm immediately drawn to this color so i'll be trying out this color and by the way i haven't put anything on my eye the only thing that's there is the uh, concealer that i pulled down from my eye eyebrows when i was uh, drawing my eyebrows that is all that's there so i'm not trying to manipulate how it sits on my eye i'm just going to be using it the way it is just like that so yeah let's try oh okay just as i'm starting you can see there's a little bit of fallout on the palette itself i don't think you can see it here but there's some fallout but let's see how pigmented this is okay this this is actually very good it's it has this nice red that is actually very beautiful okay so guys i'm so impressed right now because this red is very pigmented you can see how it looks on my eye right now it sits very well i don't have any fallouts apparently there were some fallouts when i was picking them but i don't know maybe i just didn't pick them well but right here there's no fallout at all so this is actually very good so um, i'm also going to try out hmm let me try out this orange right here so i'll be trying out this color Okay, so this one doesn't have so much pigment in it. I was hoping it would go, it was going to be a very bright uh, orange, but it is not. So you have to pack a lot for it to actually show. I don't even think it can show on, on the video right now. It's not showing that much, but it is there. So with this particular one, it is not so much pigmented but yeah so like that so because i want to try out so many colors on this uh, palette i'm also going to try out yellow this yellow right here let me just see how this comes out on my eye So it's also not a very bright yellow actually it is um it does have some fallouts on this particular one i don't know why it has fallouts but it does and so yeah it's not so bright you can see it's not so pigmented I would say so you need to pack like the good part is the more you pack the brighter it becomes so you have to you can actually control how bright it is so it doesn't control you it you control it so if you need it to be brighter you keep on packing until you get the kind of um, brightness that you want so you can see this is um, what it looks like right now so I am going to finish off this um, eye with um, a purple. Let me see how this holds the bottom of my eye. Ooh, I, I actually love this. I love how this one is coming out. I look like uh, an exotic bird right now <laughs> so I actually like how this one is sitting on my eye it does not have any fallout and this is how I look on this color so I've tried to use some bright colors on this eye so let me try to use some matte colors on the other eye of course red is matte but let me just try to use i'll try to focus on the greens on the other eye like you see this guy i was actually focused 
more on this side so now i'm going to try to focus on the other side for the next eye but i think so far so good yeah so let's see how the other eye sits up so i'm going to start by um using this green right here let me just okay no let me start with this one because it's deep it's a dark green okay this this is actually the way i thought it would turn out like it's not so bright so i don't expect it to be bright and it does not have so many fallouts so this is actually doing well let me also um try but i tried this yellow let me try this one right here or should i do a pink okay let me try this pink right here i don't really like how this one okay it looks better right in person but i don't like how it's looking here it's looking like a silver but mm -mm. i don't really like this one very much i was hoping it would be brighter than the way it is so let's also try blue there's a blue right here so i'm using this blue here for my middle part of my eye So I think I'm, I'm much more in love with the colors that are on this side than the colors that are this side like truth be told I don't know this color these colors right here were sitting well but I don't know what's happening this side this is just not working for me no it's not working let me just try to blend it out on top of my crease like that mm -mm anyway so uh for the bottom part let me use uh, this this yellow right here this i was hoping to get a very bright yellow but mm -mm. You can see i can hardly see anything and you guys can literally have like you can't see anything on the bottom but i'm actually packing uh the matte yellow down here and it is just not working it's just not working and mm -mm. anyway so yeah i think i've tried out a few of the colors right here let me just try out a glitter just so that because i've tried out some shimmer colors and i've also tried out some matte colors so let me now try out a glitter see how it sits on my eye so i'm going to use this brush right here so let me try let me use a blue we have this blue this one okay let me just try to use my finger just because people just because people say glitter works well if you use your finger so let me just use my finger okay it works better with the finger actually so it does have some creamy feel so it's not it does have some creamy feel on it so this which is good and i i don't have any fallouts you can see there are no fallouts right here so okay the glitter is doing fine for me because glitter is very difficult and if this can sit well like this then yeah i think it is doing fine so i have just packed some right there just to see how it feels i actually think the glitter is okay of course i'm not doing this uh properly and yeah let me just try another glitter i'll use this one right here or rather then can i no okay i'll use this one on the other eye let me just try to pick up a few and pack them here oh this i love like I'm, I'm loving this one. I love how it sits on my eye. I love how it is coming out. Do you see that? Like this is beautiful. 
oh this is nice damn hello okay i love how this eye is looking you guys like i know some of you are like what the dramaticness is going on but keep your negativity to yourself i'm loving myself right now <laughs> So yeah, let us try. Okay, because it, uh, the yellow didn't work for my bottom, uh, for the other eye, it looks so different from this one. So let me just, okay, let me try to use this red here. This one. It is a deep red, just to give this eye some dramaticness. I hope this one is bright. Okay, so I'm loving how this one is coming out right now. Ooh. Oh yeah. Okay. Come through, beautiful color, come through. Come through, beautiful color, come through. So this is, oh, it has just woken up my eye right now. I actually look awake right now. Mm, 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 mm. So guys, I think, um, let me just put on my lashes, then I'll come back to you guys very soon to give you my, like what I think about the final uh, product. So guys, as you can see, I went ahead and did my eyelashes off camera. I must say, I'm loving the eyelashes. Like, they look at, like, they are beautiful. I love the length. I love how fluffy they are. I love how they, how dramatic they make my eye look. So I, I like what they bring to my face, you know? So my face was, um like this but now it is bright and uh, it makes even my uh, my makeup look better so i'm in love with the eyelashes like they are bomb i, I would recommend them to any anybody any anyone so now coming to the makeup palette i actually love the makeup palette generally i love how it comes i love everything about it but then um i have noticed that there are some colors that are not so pigmented and then we have some colors that are pigmented so from my observation i would say the the, the, the brighter colors are actually more pigmented than the um, the not so bright colors i don't know how i would say this but the reds the deep like let me just say you see this part i feel like these colors that are this side are so pigmented but these ones that are this side are subtle so i actually think it brings a good feel to the palette because if you want a deep color if you want your eye to be dramatic you're definitely going to go for a more dramatic more pigmented colors but if you want your eye to be subtle and you want you know you're going to you're going for that cool look like cool and calm look then definitely the other side of the palette is definitely for you so would I recommend somebody to buy this palette? Of course I would because it's actually colors for everybody. It has everything in it. It has the shimmer colors. It has the matte colors. It also has the glitter in it. And then on top of that, it has the pigmented colors and the not so pigmented colors. So it actually, it feels like it caters for everybody. It is a palette that I would definitely uh, recommend somebody to get. If you want something that is very, 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 very bright, like something with very pigmented colors, then this one is not definitely for you. But if you want a mixture of both, so it has you on the good days when you want to be bright and all out there, it has you. And then on those days when you want to be subtle and uh, just collected and, um, you know, a, a, a little bit laid back, it still got you. So if that's what you're looking for, then definitely this is a, uh, this is a palette for you. I would recommend it 100%. If you want uh, something that is uh, shimmery, it has you. It, if you want something dramatic, it has you. If you want something that is glitter, it definitely has you. And let me just stress this out. I love the glitters that it has. They are creamy so they stick to your eye they're not going to fall off they know that they don't need so much glue you just use your finger and you're done like it has you it's going to sit on your eye like till forever until you want to wash it off already of course so yeah that is like the end of my video hope you guys enjoyed it let me know what you think i should do in my next review how do you think i did in this review do you think i did well should i slow down should i what should i change what should i continue doing yeah so just leave those comments in the comment section i'll definitely appreciate them and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and also to like this video see you in the next video you guys i love you